Hey, if you have a WordPress website and you're using Elementor and particularly you're using Elementor contact form, you could receive a lot of spam emails uh, from that contact form. And the only way to stop having spam emails is actually adding a reCAPTCHA. reCAPTCHA will allow you to stop having spams. And of course, it's so easy to add and we are going to use Google reCAPTCHA. There are two types of reCAPTCHA, the V2 and the V3. So version one is actually, you know, the, the classic reCAPTCHA where you click on the little box, you have those kind of, you know, uh, puzzle to do. And the new reCAPTCHA, the V3, uh, of course, does this all automatically, but it has some little issue. I had a client once that was not able to get into his website. He was uh, being blocked from the reCAPTCHA because in the team they was using all the same Wi-Fi and of course the website was seeing a lot of connection by the same Wi-Fi so they got a little bit blocked and that's why we are going to install the v2 but you will also see how to install the v3 if you want to get the latest version of it I'm Aryan Shirani nice to meet you I'm really happy to have you here on my videos and uh, of course, I really appreciate guys if you click on the like button, subscribe to the channel and notification bell. This would help me grow and of course make more video tutorials. So let's start. First of all, check the plugins, Elementor, Elementor Pro installed and the appearance, teams and then we have Hello Team. Of course, everything in the description, you find the links. So let's go on a new tab and search for reCAPTCHA from Google like that and then click on reCAPTCHA and of course here you have your panel like you click on v3 admin console for example and now you can see your you know existing website or just create a new one so as you can see i have a few here uh we have v2 and v3 so i'm going to create a v2 as i said at the beginning of this video it's uh, maybe more secure for the moment um, so click on this create on label you can add the domain of your website great you select the version of your reCAPTCHA in this case v2 keep everything like this and then add again your domain here great and you should accept the reCAPTCHA terms and service of course read it and submit Great, now we have our keys, okay? We are going to add it to Elementor. So copy the first one, go on Elementor, and then go on Settings, Integration, and here on Side Key, just paste your code. Great, now we just need to save it. Now let's go on our Pages all pages and here I have a contact form that I did previously in another tutorial added with Elementor of course just click on the form and on the left panel we are going to add a new item drop down on the type of item and we are going to select reCAPTCHA as you can see there is also the v3 uh, but we are going to use the v2 so reCAPTCHA and as you can see everything is done just update the page and you're good to go so just test it click on here and as you can see working fine great that was pretty easy right so guys if the tutorial was useful please don't forget the thumbs up subscribe to the channel and notification bell and i will see you in the next video bye